Oh, he doesn't love you. <laughs> <laughs> How is it going to date Lord, Loyalist Kingdom? My name is Dwayne. <laughs> We're Dwayne and Jazz. And I like you bounce on the couch. I said, oh, oh. I'm sorry for landing so hard. Yeah. But um, do you have a Niga Higa over dramatic people? And if you guys want to get your reaction requests heard and felt, make sure to follow us on our social media link in the description below. Yes, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Let's dive on it. Alright. I am not in focus. Sorry guys, I'm sick. <laughs> I have to deal with the nasal nasalness. Nasaliness. <sighs> How do we start this? That hey was guys, you, like, yesterday. Today I went to Thailand on one of my and that yeah. MP just so happens to be... This <laughs> is... <laughs> you know when people text messages when you do a new video at a time rather than putting all the texts into one yes. text message so now you have like 20 notifications? Yes. Yeah, I hate that. Oh, and also... <laughs> Over dramatic people. Oh, come on. Oh my goodness. I'm kidding. I'm not even gonna redo this. I'm just gonna let it go. <laughs> Over dramatic people. So that's what I'm we probably all know at least one over dramatic person. And if yes. you don't have anyone like this in your life, it's probably you. because it's you. Mm -hmm. And you don't think that you're being over dramatic because over dramatic situations are like normal situations to over dramatic people. Mm -hmm. And it's not necessarily a bad thing. It's just people like myself who aren't fond of drama get a little annoyed sometimes. And you guys mm -hmm. know what kind of people I'm talking about, right? These are the people yes. that can literally make a big deal out of anything, no matter how small it is. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. What? Dana posted a picture on Instagram 20 minutes ago. So? So? That means she's on Instagram. That's so? Bad. Uh, yeah. She didn't like my post and I tagged her on it like three hours ago. So what? Yeah, that's awful. Okay. And by okay. making this a bigger deal, these people actually create drama that was never there. <laughs> so you're not actually gonna go over there. I have to confront her. She's my best friend. What if she just didn't see it? Okay, I tagged her and I know she keeps her notifications on, so she definitely saw it and chose not to like it, so there's something 100,000% wrong. I have to talk to her. What? Then, even when they come to realize that there was no drama in At the first all. place. And you was just freaking. Hey, what's your problem with me? Huh? Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, I know, so why didn't you like it? I didn't even know you posted. Yeah, right. I tagged you in it like three hours ago. See? I mean, come on. We always like each other's photos, and like, I don't even know what, uh, why you... You tagged the wrong account. Wait, what? Yeah, yeah, mine's the one with the underscore. Oh, yeah. yeah. But being the overdramatic person that they are, I they somehow would. find a way to create even more drama out of that. Because what's life without drama? Wait, I'm so sorry. No, no, don't even worry about it. I would do the same, oh, girl. I know, like, it's totally overreacted, so crazy. Yes, he drove all the way to my house <laughs> for a picture. He warned me that you're on your way. Oh, uh. <laughs> Ryan texted you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so funny. Oh my god, it's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. Oh, yeah. That's <laughs> so funny, huh? You know when people That's text probably, message you one yeah, word at a time rather than him. putting all the text mm -hmm. into yeah. one text message so now you have like 20 notifications? Yeah. <laughs> I think you can probably see over dramatic people are some of the most annoying people in the world. But if you want to look on the bright side, while being annoying, they're actually some of the most interesting and entertaining people to be around because they're never bored. Bored is an emotion that over dramatic people hardly ever feel because going their on. mind can make anything and everything seem important and interesting. They have yes. the power to basically take nothing and turn it into an incredibly important big deal. It's basically like clickbait. Actually, that's a pretty good saying. Over Real life people clickbait, are yeah. basically like living clickbait. Whoa. Whoa. I almost got hit by a car. I almost died. Yes. <laughs> Come here, Rocket. Come here. Oh. Come here. Oh, he doesn't love you. Did <laughs> 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 you see the? <laughs> Come on, aren't you being a little over dramatic? Excuse me. How would you know what it would feel like if you never had one before? Wait a second. Wait, no, you're right. I've never had a period before. <laughs> what? <laughs> You're lonely. Oh, you're starving. Yeah, I'm starving. Yeah, I'm starving. The floor is lava. <laughs> okay, obviously I exaggerated, but that's kind of the whole point. That's a textbook example of an overdramatic person yes. taking a situation that barely happened and then making it into it's something amazing. Yes, yeah, like I almost died today. It actually got me kind of interested and got me thinking. Like, what makes overdramatic people want to do this? Is it because they attention. love drama, or maybe they just attention. want more attention? Yeah. I just couldn't figure it out. Then I thought maybe I'm wrong. You know, maybe it's not for attention or because they love drama. Some people are just different. I mean, there's two ends of the spectrum. There's like emotional thinkers and logical thinkers. Mm -hmm. And I think if you're on the emotional side, that's like the overdramatic people. Like myself. 
myself or more on the logical side. And just to be clear, I'm not saying either side is wrong. We're just different people. Emotional just people think a different see way. Things exactly. Different from a logical person. And it's because they literally see life in a different way. I mean, if that's mm -hmm. the case, that's actually pretty amazing. Because life for over dramatic people are always exciting. Their life is like a movie. It's yes. a drama. You see, I presented all those skits earlier from my perspective. You know, the, the boring perspective, the logical one. <laughs> Imagine what those little situations would look like. They would blow it up. A over dramatic person. Take a look. The slow motion. <laughs> <laughs> like a dog. I don't know how to tell you this. I don't even know how it happened, but uh, I'm pregnant. <laughs> and drowned him. <laughs> this normally like growl people. I'm gonna be a fast and furious right there. The floor oh. is literal lava. I'm pregnant. I have a baby inside. How me. is that even possible? <laughs> <laughs> it's like a movie. What are you talking about? Oh. My nipples are taping. You don't even have them. Oh. Don't you ever talk about my nipples again? Clickbait. Clickbait. Coming the theater, movie. theater. Never. Never forget the nipples. Anyway, the moral of the story here is that there are just different types of people in this world. Yes, those overly emotional, overly dramatic people might seem mm -hmm. incredibly annoying to someone like me, and I'm sure a bunch of you as well. But I mean, it's yes. not their fault, it's just how they think. That's just how they see life. So if you ever get annoyed or you have to deal with an overdramatic person in your mm -hmm. life, don't even bother trying to be reasonable. Don't try to change them. You're never gonna win in trying to convince a overdramatic, over emotional thinker to think logically because that's just not who they are. My advice right. to you, and the only thing that you can do is to just accept them for who they are. Are, mm -hmm. Admit defeat, let them be there. Or there's also mm -hmm. one last trick you could also speak their language and be even more over dramatic. Like, oh my god, yes. So, how long have you guys been sleeping together? What? Don't what? you lie to me. I was texting you the whole time on the way back from our house, so I know you know what I'm talking about. Wait a second. You were texting the whole time? Yeah, and you weren't responding, so I know you were talking to her. So you were texting and driving? Yeah, but. <laughs> <laughs> Switched it around. I from a man who was texting and driving. You don't even have a sister. How are you going to bring that out? Yeah. I've always wanted a sister. Okay, I didn't know you wanted a sister. I had no idea. Oh, I did. And now you know. I'm sorry. Well, I'm sorry too then. Forget about it. I'm sorry. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that face. <laughs> so <gross>. <laughs> <laughs> I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that a lot too. Dope. But there are people I I've known somebody that was just overly dramatic. Mm -hmm. overly we all have that friend that was time. just yeah. I don't talk Did to them anymore. Did that really happen? Yeah, like I don't talk to them anymore. Yeah, because they tend to be Yeah, because I just like I just can't I can't deal with this. Yeah. I just can't. Nah, I totally understand. Like understand. literally, like I used to hate like when people would be like complaining about their jobs or mm -hmm. going to work, and they'll be like, oh oh my god, you'll never believe what happened. My mom forced me to get a job. Do you believe that? Do you believe oh that? my god, how mean is she? I have to actually go to work and do something for eight hours so I can get money. How yeah. can I live like this? Like I used to be sitting there just like looking at them like, are you serious? I'm literally working while I'm in high school and you're complaining yeah. that your mom is forcing you? Like, are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> like, I used to be like, okay, I just can't deal with that. Like, that's that's life. I, I, that's, I have to it's like you like have to too. have money. To live, yeah. unless you want to, like, you know, just be, be like homeless, a be foozy too. You know yeah. I mean? <laughs> anyway, guys, please comment below. Tell us, <laughs> don't forget to like, subscribe. This is where, guys, this is.